good morning y'all i am now in my car and i can actually talk um, my roommate was sleeping this morning so i didn't want to wake her up with a vlogging but i just wanted to introduce myself before i head to the gym my name is marley and i'm a transfer student here at seu and i love southeastern so i can't wait to kind of show you what a day at southeastern looks like with all the chapels and everything that's um to come throughout the day so i'm going to bring you along in the day in the life as a nursing major at SEU so it's gonna be a busy but fun day and I can't wait to bring you guys along all right so just made it to the gym and the nice part about Lakeland if you're a gym rat there is so many gyms throughout Lakeland but something super sweet that SEU did is they actually gave all their students a membership to a really nice gym in Lakeland called just move fitness and so that's where I'm gonna be working out today I love this gym specifically because they have so many like workout classes so if you're into like cycling and stuff they have all that stuff a lot of times my roommates and I will come work out here and do a cycling class together and just get like a little uh, brain break so but today I think I'm gonna be doing just some cardio and some core stuff so I'm gonna head into the gym and bring you guys with me Okay, so just finished my workout and it was good, good little way to wake me up for sure. I was not woken up when I walked in, but feeling good now, but I'm actually gonna go grab a coffee. Um, this is not an everyday thing, but it's a Monday and sometimes you just need it. So I'm gonna pick up my roommate and I a coffee since I kind of woke her up vlogging this morning. And then I'm gonna go uh, probably read my Bible and then get ready before I start my day with classes. So let's go. Okay, so I just got back on campus and we will give you a whole dorm tour later, but I just kind of wanted to show you what our building looks like. So we live in Esperanza, we're in an eight man and it's two per room. So I'll give you a little look. So my morning routine is kind of different every morning, but there is two things I kind of try to keep in routine because just being in nursing, it can get so stressful with the workload and everything like that. So it helps to kind of have those outlets or those little pockets of peace throughout your day. So for me, that's working out. I typically do that every morning like I did this morning. And then also the second part of just normalcy in my day and just um, kind of what gives me peace to keep pushing on is definitely reading my Bible every morning. So I try to have some quiet time with the Lord just before I start my day so it kind of sets my heart posture for the whole rest of the day so that's what I'm gonna do now um, right now I'm currently in first Timothy I'm gonna be reading chapter 2 today I usually read like a chapter a day I'm gonna do that and then kind of get ready for my day so I just wanted to like put that out there that obviously not every day my routine is you know put together or perfect or going to get coffee things like that but um, the two things I try to stay consistent with are those two things yeah I'm gonna go ahead and do my quiet time now Okay, so I just finished getting ready for the day and here's the fit of the day, just simple. My first class is at 10 o'clock. It's 9.50 right now, so I'm gonna head to class. I have Christian thought and practice first and then usually I have a lab. I usually go from 10 a.m. to like 1.50, but today I don't have my lab. It's only on Wednesday. So my roommate and I are gonna probably grab some lunch at Einstein Bagels and then I have um, microbio and stats. So I'm gonna head to class and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Buster. Hi. Okay, so now I'm with my roommate Maddie, Hi. and we are gonna go get lunch at Einstein Bagels. And we just went to the library. I had to print out some stuff for class, and we got to see a cute little puppy that was in the library. His name is Buster, so it was super fun. A little serotonin boost, and super good day so far. My next class is at 12, so I'm gonna grab a bite to eat and relax a little bit before the hard classes kick in. Maddie, give us your go-to Einstein order. Okay, so it definitely depends on the day, but I think right now, probably the blueberry bagel with cream cheese. I like a meal exchange, 
to number one. And then I get Fire. a Sprite or yes. a coffee. It depends. So good. Usually, I do the egg and cheese on a bagel, but recently, just the plain bagel with cream cheese has just been so good. So, <laughs> I love bagels. I'm going to microbio now. Maddie's walking me to class, yes. and then she's leaving me. But anyways, I will give you a little peek of the health and science building. This is where I spent all my time as a nursing student. Okay, I'm all done with classes. I finished microbio and stats, and then just picked up a bunch of mail from the mailroom. I have Jada here. Hi. <laughs> That's Jada. She is doing her master's in what? An MBA in sports management. Jada and I met on a dance team, and she's actually we one of the reasons I transferred. <laughs> Yay! I'm all done with classes and I'm about to go to Portico with my roommate and Jada um, to work on some homework. But before I went and headed over there, I wanted to just kind of talk about why I love SEU since making the transfer. So at my old school, I just wasn't super happy with just the community and all that stuff. And I actually found myself coming to SEU a lot for the chapels and the worship nights, which are so, so awesome. From there, I just kind of prayed about it and the Lord definitely opened doors to this school and since just attending SEU. It's definitely just been such a God-given thing. I think the scariest thing as a transfer is just wondering if you'll find your people because people have already made their friends or you may feel like you're kind of behind your class. But Truly, it's just been so awesome. The community here is so great. There's just so many ways to get involved. So my biggest advice, if you are a transfer or you're looking at coming to SEU, just get involved, whatever that looks like. There's so many opportunities that you can just really get plugged in and you can serve at chapels or you can get involved in different clubs and all those things and you can really find your people, meet your groups. And the nursing program here is so great. All the professors are so awesome, just how they integrate faith even into those science-based classes. It's just super sweet. I love SEU and if you have any questions about transfer or just um, the school in general, we're gonna link a bunch of links below so that you can get connected and get those questions answered. Okay, so now I'm with my roommate Maddie at Portico, which is our little coffee shop on campus. It has coffee, tea, acai, and the coffee is so good, but even better, a lot of the proceeds go to the missions that we do here at SEU, so that's my favorite part. But we're gonna do some homework here for a little bit and then probably grab some dinner before we go serve at chapel tonight. And yeah, it's just a really chill place in here. It's super great because everybody hangs out here, so you get to kind of talk with your friends, do some homework, so that's what we're gonna do. So I just got back to the dorm. I literally was so slammed with homework and midterms that I literally lost track of time. So it's 5.37 now. I have to go volunteer at chapel at six. So I'm gonna eat real quick. I grabbed Chick-fil-A for dinner. So it's super busy, but super fun. Love serving at chapel. So we're gonna head over there soon. I'm gonna get changed real quick and eat my Chick-fil-A because I'm starving. Okay, I don't know if I mentioned that, but we do have Chick-fil-A on campus. So clutch. Seriously cannot wait to eat. You know, you can't go wrong with Chick-fil-A, so. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go serve at chapel now. Yay! We'll try to get some clips in, but we're super excited. Do um, you have any final thoughts to add in? Um, no. No? Just serve chapel. Just serve chapel. Go five. <laughs> hey! <laughs> So it actually is the next morning, but we got back from chapel pretty late last night. There's two chapels here at SEU, so we have a 7 p.m. and a 9 p.m. And it was so, so powerful, so I actually stayed in home, served at both. I love chapels here at SEU, and just serving is so much fun, being able to connect with people. So I loved it. And then when I got back, everybody was sleeping, so I didn't want to wake everyone up by filming. But I went to the library, and I studied for a stats test that I have today. And that was pretty much the rest of my day. And it was just a super good day, and I'm glad that I got to bring you guys along um, in a busy day in the life of a nursing student. 
here at SEU and um, I just wanted to remind you guys that if you have any questions about transferring or wanting to know more, we're going to leave all the links down below for y'all so that you can access those. And I want to remind you to just subscribe, check out our Instagram and our TikTok and all those fun things to stay up to date with everything here happening at SEU. And as promised, now that I have daylight, I wanted to give y'all a quick little room tour um, of our place so that you can kind of see what a room here at SEU looks like. We live in, again, Esperanza, and it is an eight-man suite and two per room. So, um, yeah, super fun, and I'm going to give you a quick little room tour before we wrap up today's little video. that wraps up this day in the life thank you again for joining along in my day and i hope to see you at seu soon whether you're a new student or wanting to transfer this is definitely the home to be and i hope that y'all gained some insight watching this day in the life and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed